Good morning, middle school. Buenos dias, estudiantes. Bonjour, estudiantes. Today is a B day. Please stand and recite the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today for lunch, there's a Mexican taco, soft shell, or tortilla chips with brown rice, whole kernel corn, assorted fruit, fruit or juice. There is a cross-country varsity meet, away versus Leroy. Middle school weight room training will be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. You only need to go one day this week for training. Please sign up in the main office. Weight room will be offered Monday and Tuesday starting October 10th. Attention Odyssey of the Mind team members, we are meeting in Mr. Waldron's room after school this Thursday. This week is Spirit Week. Today is Twin Day. Wednesday is a celebration of the Arts Character Day. Thursday is School Color Day. Sixth grade is white, seventh grade is orange, and eighth grade is blue. Attention athletes, anyone interested in joining the Varsity Alpine Ski Team, there will be an informational meeting this Thursday at 2.20 in the high school large cafeteria. Late bus passes will be available. Come see what it is all about. Community Service Club baking meetings are canceled this week. Community Service Club members who completed proposals, please meet on Wednesday, October 4th, tomorrow, in Mrs. Carter's room. If you can't make it, See Mrs. Carter or Mrs. Peace. There are girls in our meals today. Banana pops will be for sale all next week for 75 cents. Enjoy this delicious chocolatey creation. All proceeds will go to help the hurricane victims. We have two special announcements. Oh, I'm so hungry after school. What about you? Yeah, I wish there was a cold but healthy treat I could buy. Hey, I heard there are banana pops in Livonia Middle School. It's 50 cents for a small banana pop and 75 cents for a large one. What's the cost? Well, it's going to help the hurricane victims. The money we collect is going to help them buy food, water, and help to build houses. So, buy banana pops now. Good morning, middle school. Yesterday, we had our sixth game of the season for modified football against Geneseo here in Livonia, and it was a battle. But the boys came out victorious at the end with a 14 to nothing win. Uh, Matt Connor scored a touchdown, uh, Maddox Olson scored a touchdown, and Jake Watkins had a two-point conversion. And I'd love to give you more details, but we got a long announcements coming up right now. Um, great job, boys. Very proud of you. And uh, let's take it to Lex Warsaw next week. It's that time of year for coupon book sales, ladies and gentlemen. And on a serious note, it's very important that we sell these coupon books. We spent a lot of money last year, more than we ever have. So we're in the hole a little bit. So we need everybody to participate and sell a coupon book. So what is a coupon book? A coupon book is a book with a tremendous amount of awesome coupons in it. There's coupon books to restaurants, to shops, to stores. Um, Dick's Sporting Goods one is in there. You get a $20 coupon, practically pays for the book itself. Um, where to get the coupon books? Well, if you're in sixth grade, okay, you're going to report to Mr. Shoner. And you go to Mr. Shoner and you will grab a coupon book from him. You will also grab a selling envelope from him. All sixth graders will report to Mr. Shoner. All seventh and eighth graders will come to my room to see me for a coupon book and selling envelope. How to sell them? Well, you go door to door. You have your mom and dad take them to, the, to, to work and they sell them at the office. You call up grandma and grandpa, aunts and uncles. 
Um, any way you can sell a book is going to be a big help for us. When you go to collect the money, all right, checks, some people might want to pay you right on the spot. So checks are made out to Livonia Central School District, right? And um, some people will say, well, when I get my book, I'll give you a check. That's okay. But what you have to do is record each person's name, right? How many books they want and what type of book they want. Now we sell the Western New York book, which is good in Rochester and the surrounding counties. But on the back, there are books that some people and a lot of people actually lately have been buying them for their friends in North Carolina, California, Florida, uh, family members all around the United States. Tell, tell your family Christmas presents, holiday gifts, things like that. We buy them for my mom and dad and sister, mom and dad down in Jersey, sister back home in Westchester. And they use them a ton. Because again, there's coupons for all sorts of national stores as well as local things to that area. They're not going to get coupons to Rochester area stores. Great but point. But when you do come in, you have to make sure you tell us, hey, we, I sold seven books. Great, but one of them is to Kentucky. All right, because we need to know because we have to order those books special and then they come delivered to us and then we get them to you. All right, very important on that one. When you finish selling your, um, your coupon books, we're gonna sell them for the month of October, starting today. Um, uh, best bet would probably be to start tomorrow morning. When can you come see us to get these books? Every morning, you can come to Mr. Shoner's room, sixth graders and seventh eighth graders, you can come to um, my room to get the books, all right? Everyone needs to come down, you need to get an envelope, you need to get a book, and then you go out and sell. When you're done selling it towards the end of October, we'll get on the announcements and we'll say, hey, it's time to turn in your envelopes. You come in, you turn your envelopes into us and we'll give you books. And if we have to order the books, we'll order the books. It usually takes about four or five days to get the books in. Um, why do we sell these books? Well, the money raised goes to help fund our dances, our lock-in that we have. Um, we help support the Rochester Broadway Theater League show that we go to. We help support the Darien Lake Fun Day that we do at the end of the year. We help support the um, Fun Day before Christmas where we go to the movies. Um, we've done Red Wing games before, Lancer yeah, soccer games. games before, Nighthawk games before. Uh, we do a movie night up in the cafeteria. We do the Spirit Weeks. We do um, all those great things. And then we have an administrator who has a, a, a spending habit and we like to uh, buy t-shirts for everybody, and we like to buy magnets and whatever else comes across uh, this person's desk. <laughs> so, <clears throat> if you sell a lot of these books, and what do we mean by a lot? A seven, right? If you sell seven books, you get to go to Darien Lake for free at the end of the year. Usually the tickets are about 30 bucks. Um, we come up with, a, we pay 20 bucks of it, and you guys usually pay 10. Uh, you get to go to Darien Lake for free. You don't have to come up with a $10. Um, if you sell uh, any book, you get to put your name uh, in a coupon or a raffle, and we get to raffle off a TV and numerous iTunes gift cards, Walmart gift cards, and other things that we come up with. So by selling every, each time you sell a book, you get to put one uh, raffle ticket in for the raffle that we do at Christmas time uh, during our Christmas fun day. It's really important that each student sells one book at least, all right? One book, and that will put us way over the top that we need. So please don't sit there and say, yeah, whatever. Take a chance. Help support your school. Help make it a better place. Help make it be awesome. Anything else? Uh, just this book. If you take a book and you do not sell a book, this book needs to come back. This is not a free book that your family is being given. Right? You are welcome to buy the book, simply mom and dad want one, so we're going to buy this one. But if you do not sell a book, this book needs to come back to us, please. An important note, this book is your selling tool, right? You come to us, you get a book, and you get an envelope, but you don't give this book to anybody. You go to the person, you sit there and say, would you like to buy this book? Yes. They say yes. Would you please fill in your name and how many books you want? very much. They can take a look at it to say, look, it's a great book. Think, no, 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 you can't leave with it. I need to go to the next person. And then you go to the next person and you use the book as a style. You always keep this book with you, okay? 
when you get done at the end, you come with us with this, and then we give you a stack of these to give back to the people that you sold them to. That's good. I think we got it all. If you have any questions, please come see Mr. Schoner or myself. Please, tomorrow morning, come to our, our, uh, our rooms and start selling coupon books. Thanks. Thank you. Have a tornado Tuesday, middle school.